So tonight I'm here to show you one of the projects I've been working on. Uh, this one I've been working on for a little while. This is a Arduino handheld 8-bit video game. Um, I used a screen from Adafruit. It's a 240 by 320 LCD screen. Um, it's like 18-bit color. Uh, I used a Arduino Mini Pro from SparkFun, a analog joystick for input, and uh, four buttons here. Um, here is a boost peak converter because this runs at 5 volts. This is a charger for USB. Um, so this switch controls which source you're using, either this source or this source. Right now it's using the USB. If I switch it to there, it'd be using the battery. Um, and here's a little Pezio buzzer. That's the programming port right there. It's a little six pin port. Um, back here is the circuitry. Um, here I've Velcroed a battery onto this. And you can see here, if I get the screen to clear up, I've taken hot glue and covered all of the wires uh, there's some of the display wires that way that they wouldn't get messed up in the process of playing and there's the battery port I desoldered it off of the uh, USB charger and put it at the back kind of hard for me to get this back on here okay but now I can show you um, a game I've worked on with it um, so this switch cuts on the boost peak, and then this switch selects the power source, and then it goes straight into the game. Uh, so this is Pong. If you can see here, I've got a little ball. It's actually a box uh, hitting each side, and the Pezio is going off whenever I hit it. And the um, analog joystick is what's controlling this movement. So as I move left or right, that's what's happening. Um, and you may see that the color has changed. It was yellow initially and now it's green. Um, it randomly has a chance to change color. Well, no, the change color happens after a certain amount of um, times for it to hit the bar. I think every four times it hits the bar, it'll change color. So right there's how many I got. That was 12. But um, if you hit the edges of the bar, it also has a chance to change uh, X speed and Y speed at the same time. Uh, but this is what I've been working on. Um, I plan to develop more games, I just haven't got around to it yet. But I hope you enjoyed the video. Thanks for watching.